Well, hey y'all, how are y'all doing today? Um, today, I wanted to uh, just kind of sit back and talk about um, a new product. Well, it's not a new product, uh, like it just came out, but it's one that <clears throat> I am uh, gonna try for new for me. Um, it, uh, I've already got my, um, my um, base down. I got my primer, my base down, and um, all that. And what I'm using is the um, the one I was talking about the other day is the um, the Maybelline Dream BB Fresh. Um, it says eight in one beauty balm skin perfector. Um, it has an SPF of 30. Pomegranate pomegranate extract. Um, it's 110 light medium sheer tint. And it looks like this right here. And I love this. Um, it is just, I mean, I, I like it better than um, like a total foundation. Um, because to me, this is, for me, it is a foundation. Um, I don't need, or I don't want much. I don't have to have, you know, an extreme amount. Um, I'm 53. It's not like I'm out trying to catch somebody or anything like that. And I want to look good, and to me, this gives me just enough to take the redness away, cover some spots, and um, then I wanted to try, I've tried several different um, powders to go over, and I'm just not exactly happy with them. So what I thought I would try today is this, um, I had tried the Maybelline... No, I think it was the L'Oreal. Here it is. I tried the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow Powder. But I didn't... Um, it was okay, but I didn't really like it because it has specks of glitter in it. And I don't like specks of glitter on my face. I don't mind a glow. I don't mind just a sheen. A little bit of sheen, not too much. A little bit of sheen on my face because I do have dry skin. But I don't want glitter unless I am putting glitter you know, on my eyes, something like that. But I very seldom do I use glitter. It's more of a satiny sheen color. So let's go ahead and open this puppy up. I haven't opened it yet. And because I didn't want to think I'd been using it. It just takes me a little bit to want to tear up my nails, but... Oh, how they, okay. Now, it comes with, so, oh yeah, here we go. Most of them open up um, where they have a sponge underneath, um, and it feels okay, but I don't ever use these. Um, they, they're always rough around the edge, and they're just real cheap little um, sponges, so, um, I usually just toss those and I had the um, I have a velour uh, puff um, nice and clean and it's just a little stained but it is clean and so I'm going to use that because it really um, is very soft smooth and it puts the, the powder on very nicely uh, we'll try it and we'll see how it does so we're going to go ahead and um, put this on and see how it works. It's Maybelline, so I'm hoping that it works with this really well. So let's see what we can do here. This, um, these you can just put in the wash. I put them in a little bag and put it put them in the wash with my um, face wipes, uh, face rags that I have. I clean my face with a, um, with those, um, what do I call, they're like, um, uh, microfiber rags, you know, that, that you can take the makeup off without soap or anything, but I use cleanser. But I love putting a hot rag on my face in the mornings, and those really do help take off the makeup without stretching your face too much 
Looks like this is going on pretty smooth. I may have found a winner here. Sometimes uh, using the products that go together. I was using the Dream Wonder uh, powder with this, and it was just too much. It was too cakey. Um, I used it like I bought three of those and used them all the way up, thinking there was different ways maybe I should try it. And it just always ended up so cakey. Um, it could, you know, it could have been me. But um, it was always so cakey. Too much for me, you know, like a heavy makeup look. And I don't like that. But it looks like this is going to come up pretty nice here. See what we got here. Get my glasses. A brush hair on me. Well, um, as you can see, hopefully you can see well. Um, I gotta get some better lighting when we get moved. We're moving, uh, hopefully soon to a, another. We're having a home built. And um, <clears throat> I'm going to have an area where I can set up. But as you can see, it looks really smooth through here. Not really collecting in my lines because I have these um, old lady lines here. Not really collecting in there like the other did. Sorry. And then around my eyes, so I do have lots of lines in there. Used to just really cake up. Um, it's not doing that at all. Not caking up at all. Looks really nice. So I'll have to see, you know, when I uh, go throughout the day. Um, I have other videos to film, and I'll, you know, we'll be putting on a full face eventually, and going throughout my day. So um, in another video, we'll go through everything that we've put on, and we'll see how the day went. And I'll let you know with each product how they actually wore. And um, at the end of that day, and, and at the end of the day today, I will do another video and we will look at how it all wore. Anyway, I really like um, the way this um, has gone on. I like the smoothness. I like that there's no real dry, there's no dry patches at all. Um... Yeah, no flakiness, no no anything like that. Very smooth. It didn't sit in my pores. I do have a primer on. Um, I always use this, uh, pr the same primer when I do things so that I know how things set. So anyway, I really love the way this has set up. And um, like I said, I'll do an uh, end of the day video with all the products that I'm going to be doing um, this week. And we will see how they all set up, how they wear for the day. And um, I really appreciate you um, watching today, listening to me bab on about stuff. It's probably already been done by about a million YouTubers. Um, like I said, I just kind of grab things as I see them. Um, my reviews may not mean much. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm in the older section um, and I'm just an everyday person, not um, a, a makeup artist or, you know, glam guru. I'm just um, an everyday aunt and wife um so uh <clears throat> anyway um i enjoy doing this and i thank y'all for watching and until next time from my heart to yours you be blessed